This episode of At brought to you by GoToAssist Express. Learn more at GoToAssistExpress.com. So people who have watched a lot of online video may know this man. This is Bree Pettis, who you may know from the Make Video podcast. But he's doing something else now. Bree, what do you got for us back over here? Um, so me and my friends Adam and Zach figured out how to make inexpensive 3D printers that can make almost anything. So this last year we've been rocking it hard, producing kits and selling them so that you can basically get one of these things, put it together in a weekend, and then have a machine that you can just print out 3D objects with. Now traditionally 3D printing is very expensive. About yeah, you can, you can spend up to like half a million dollars on one. Yeah, that's a little bit much. Is, that's not that much, is it? No, these are, you can, our kit is nine fifty for okay, that's, everything. That's a big delta there. So, <laughs> so it's, is it a simple it yourself kit or? Yeah, you get it and you put it together. We made it simple and then we've got all the instructions online and it's a wiki. So if you make it and you've got a tip or trick, you can share it and in fact like 500 people before you have already shared their tips and tricks on the so wiki. Fully interactive. Okay, so how does it work? We've got, uh, it looks like we've got a coil of something feeding into the top of it and it's spitting it out below. How, how's that working? You've got it exactly. Uh, ABS plastic or now PLA, which is made of corn, which is, smells like french fries when you make things out of it. Mm. It gets fed into the top and heated up and then it gets kind of gooey and it draws a really thin line and draws a layer and then it moves up a little bit and on top of that layer it draws another layer and then layer after layer it makes an object. I've got some whistles here that we printed out and these are printed out one layer at a time and then when you're done you can just you've got a whistle and you can you can just blow them and you fully it, you, yeah you don't have to go to the store this is this took like less than 15 minutes to make and it's like five cents of material. Alright so with the plastic itself to make these things how, how are we gonna get our hands on that Okay, so the plastic is ABS and we buy pellets and then send it to a place where they make it, send it through a very small hole and make this filament. And we sell it on our website and you can get it. We may, we don't, we're not doing the, in, you know, the inkjet printer cartridge yeah. thing. We're so just selling it. this is not for profit. It. Yeah. Okay. And so here's, here's the number one question that I've got right now. Yeah. Will the MakerBot actually be able to make copies of itself and take over the world? <laughs> yes. So what's happening already is We've printed out parts for the MakerBot. Our MakerBots make parts for other MakerBots. We've got a few pulleys. That, so already we're starting that process. And a bunch of people have started making um, repraps, which are self-replicating rapid prototypers using the MakerBot. This is the end of everything. <laughs> no, but the cool thing, I mean, <laughs> these machines are in service to people's creativity. I don't anticipate them taking over the world and becoming so. Uh, artificial intelligence is a, is a whole other deal. Um, but it's really cool to have a machine that you can boss around and tell it to make you things and it'll make you things. Okay, okay. where do people go to find out how to get this and order one? They can go to makerbot.com and order one there. And then we have another site called thingiverse.com where you can check out all sorts of things that people have made. And it's kind of like, it's, a, it's an object sharing website. So actually Zago made this whistle and he shared it on the internet. And half an hour later, people all around the world had made one. It's, it's about the closest thing you can get to teleportation of objects. There you go. So head over to makerbot.com, check this out, and get your own before they take over the world and prevent you from doing so. Yeah. Get a, get a robot. Make stuff. This episode of At brought to you by GoToAssistExpress. Learn more at GoToAssistExpress.com.